108. Yes, John Higgins didn't pot a ball in the first room. He got a four-point penalty. Won't disturb him as yet, of course. It almost comes as a shock when a Sullivan misses a pot sometimes when he's playing okay. well, but mustn't forget how difficult the game is. Red goes, he may play for the black, he may come up the table for another colour. Had to make the pot though. Two ball needs to slow down. Perfect. Maybe a little thin off the yellow to try and split the pack. He's okay. Yeah. Yellow. Playing for the single red. Beautifully played. Very little room there past the blue off the Three. cushion for this red. Four. Higgins be up for this match, make no mistake about it. Eleven. Didn't get the split though. His first chance of the match really. John Higgins, eleven. Sullivan could do there, other than to play the up and down. Now that red has gone in just behind the brown. And we're trying to stick the cue ball in behind the black each time. You could see a lot of reds landing up towards them bolt colours. Mind, I'm saying that, and he's left this red to the right centre. So that was a real miscalculation by John Higgins. Very adept in the safety department. Makes few mistakes, John Higgins. One. Well, that was a real mistake. And if he's going to have any chance in this match, he's going to have to stay with Ronnie. Well, Ronnie's played for the cluster there. And missed them. Four. Bonnie O'Sullivan, four. I think John Higgins will be quite happy when he losing four points. Expected. I need to have scored a lot more there. Last two in the trot from John Higgins. You don't see that often. Two bad safety shots, one after another. Shaking his head down up. 
Paul's been one of his friends. He's a great brake builder as well, but safety has given him so many openings in his career. One. There's no doubt that Ronnie O'Sullivan uh, exerts pressure on his opponents out there with his high scoring. He's uh, very, very dangerous in the balls. The John Higgins there uh, played a, a safety shot that you, you wouldn't see in the local league on a Wednesday night. Eight. Or a Thursday if it comes to that. Nine. I think he's the only player in the world, Darren, I don't know how you feel about this, that I feel I could sit down and watch him and not say a word in the commentary box. We may get sacked, but... Uh yes, I'd agree with that. And he's probably, throughout my career, we played many times, and he was probably the only player that, even when I was getting beat by him, and I did have a couple of wins against him, but... Even in beating me, I used to enjoy it in a sick sort of a way. 16. But he was, uh, he was just class to watch and obviously he used to play a lot of other players that I couldn't watch. I used to turn away and wait 17. for my turn. But with him, I watched every shot. Well, he didn't strike that very good, <laughs> and it may have cost him. 24. Certainly hasn't got any easy red to take on. I'm going to look again if you can get past these three reds by the pink spot to the one into the right corner. I have to put a touch aside to turn this over. That's what he's done. <laughs> Beautiful. He doesn't hit the ball, he caresses the cue ball. Thirty. Thirty-one. <coughs> Thirty-eight. Well, I think he's already sent a message to John again. If you play anything loose or leave him mid-range any kind of lapse in concentration on the whole safety department he's going to get punished for it 46 Ronnie has been in scintillating form here this week at the Newport Centre 47 <coughs> I do feel for John Higgins to have any kind of a chance in this match he is going to have to play better than he has done all week 54 55 Just checking the scoreboard Find himself uh, 55 62. points in front. Just this red needed. 63. Begins out very little to go at. In the match so far, he's got to get started quickly. Sullivan's like a runaway train when he gets in front of 70. you. 70. 71. I think the difference between these two players so far in this match is that uh, Sullivan has got a lot of evidence that he's playing well this season, whereas 79. Uh, Higgins hasn't. We'd all expect him to find something, of course, he's a great champion. 
but he hasn't found it yet. Eighty-four. Eighty-five. Eighty-eight. Ninety. Ninety-three. Ninety-seven. He mesmerises the crowd, doesn't he? So quiet out there. It's a Sullivan at his best, and there's no greater sight in the game. He's 2 0 in front against John Higgins.